Welcome everybody, thank you for joining me. Today we're going into Goodwill. We're gonna look for items to flip online. My name is Mikey Bags of Money. I buy things from thrift stores, garage sales, storage units. I sell them on eBay, Facebook, and other places. We're gonna go in there and hopefully beat out the competition. They've been getting aggressive lately. If you've seen any of my latest videos, that's no worry, because we're gonna have a great time. We're gonna show some eBay comms. So hit that subscribe button and let's go inside. Feeling lucky. Feeling like it could be my lucky day. How you doing? Good, thanks. Got some new cards out here. Fresh stuff. Look at all of the racks right down there. One, two, three, four, five racks of kids and women's clothing. We got at least one, two racks of hard goods out here. Oh, what is this thing? Whoa, whoa. Is this a brain? Is oh oh it's a human it's a humanoid all right I'm gonna have to look at this humanoid was not expecting that was not expecting that that is for sure let's see what else we got in here we got some dominoes some toys I sometimes can do good this is from the MGM Grand Hotel five dollars what thirty dice. 30 MGM dice. I don't know. Let's investigate that one further, too. Right, pass on the fruit, obviously. And huh, it's a good start. It's a pretty good start. Let's check out this next one. Last time we just missed out on $50 golf club from our buddy. Grabbed it before we could. I was looking for some pickleball paddles. I have some cheap ones. I don't want to buy one from Amazon. I'm hoping to find one at Goodwill. A really good one. Just got to put it out there. And then it will happen. First step is you got to think it and believe it. And then you got to receive it. Oh, these are some interesting laughs. That's a nice sack like milk glass right there, painted. What are they going for? Twenty dollars with the cheap wooden base. The top school, the base ain't. Um, yeah, I'm gonna easily pass on that. Did buy some hobnail milk glass from a garage sale recently and sold on Facebook really quick. Let's paint a glass. This could be a skip, especially at $20 for Mikey boy. No way. All right, when you go shopping with friends, you learn different things. And I think there's like a monster high. So take a quick Google scan right here, $3. This one's for like 15-ish, it's pretty cool. All complete, I'll check the sell-through rate. So yeah, these are, Easy to sell, easy to list, I don't know. We'll check it out, make sure all the way at the end, but put it in the bag. Oh, Jensen CD player, vintage right here, I think, friends. If this was Sony, I'd feel a lot better, but it's coming in at $10, $10. Going pretty good, this might be worth 50 or more. Let's find out. I'm not sure on the, on the Jensen, but we'll find out. On clouds, friends. Let's see how much they want. 15 bucks. Oh, these doggies are worn right here. Look at that. Not much left. And at 15, I think. I think it's a pass. So I just gotta look up the comps. And the tops look pretty good. The bottoms are not. I need to get me some more on clouds myself. My dogs are barking lately. They are barking. Awesome shoe, though. Super comfy. These sponge things right here, oh, they'll take care of you. Maybe this was the piece we were looking for, friends. It's a TJ Maxx special. Feels kind of weird on the outside right here. That's for sure. I don't know. For sure. All right. Oh, surfing Nomi. My kind of homie right there. 
Need to head to Ventura Beach soon to visit some friends and catch some waves and some good vibes. Bring you along. It's about a year ago we had a wedding celebration out there. It was good. It was so good. Definitely have to watch it back. It's part of the fun. Oh, we got a kitty with some holes in it. Why are the holes in there? You guys tell me such amazing things in the comments. I learned so much from all of you. I do appreciate it. Oh, oh here's some William Sonoma. Originally six dollars. These look vintage, right? William Sonoma. I have to phone a friend and ask my mom. William Sonoma. Napkin rings. Possible loose eye. All right, let's investigate. Mm -hmm. Cobalt blue fishy. Oh, look at it right there. That's pretty cool. Grabbing a fish plate. Looks like it came from another thrift store or something, though. $1.99. I really almost want to bag that one. Super Court sometimes watches my videos, my super wife. She's like, oh, do we get it? And sometimes I'm happy to say we did, and sometimes I'm sad to say we didn't. So we're going to throw this one back in the pond. It's Buddy, too. Back in the pond. I also saw this the other day, Fred Football. No one's bought Fred Football yet. Pretty cute, pretty old. And this thing's really old, friends, but no one's, no one wants Fred Football. What a shame. Fred is so lonely over here at Goodwill. Come on down and make Fred a friend. All right, more Nomi the homies. Some serious thinker. This guy kind of looks like a hobo, but I think he might be refined his instrument. A wine holder? Oh yeah. Wine holder. DWK 2017. That bad boy wants some wine right there. All right folks, here come the regulars. Oh, check out all our religious figurines we got. We got the whole setup here. The whole setup. All right, friends, let's say Italy. All I know about some decorations, if they're like Fontanini or something in Italy, I don't know if these are them or not. Italy, Italy. They all are marked Italy on the bottom. All right, take a closer look. It's only $5. It's probably going to be worth the gamble. All right, set, bag them softly. All right, day in and day out, friends. Same employees, the same pickers, the same Mikey. Just out here all doing our thing. Trying to get by however we decide how. My friends, I can't read if that says something, but we're gonna look it out, because this lip was nice and thick. Had like a little extra thing right there, so I kinda dug this one, $2.99. Let's uh, probably bag it. Yeah, I'm good. I'm going this way. I'll, get, I'll see where I can. Move here, move there. All right, folks. It was a friendlier vibe today. It was a friendlier vibe, I gotta say. I don't even know what the dealie is. I just hear people say Fontanini is the best little Christmas dudes you can get. And they're made in Italy. That's all I know. And they're like figurines or something. But I found some. Look at that. Italy? Boom. So I grabbed one. I looked this one up. And of course it said Fontanini. And Mikey said Bagalicious. So we got quite a few different characters in here. And yeah, uh, even at 10 bucks a piece, there's probably over a dozen characters in here for $5. That's pretty good right there. I think we're going to take the dice. We'll lot them up. We can put them individually. That's uh, a lot of pairs. Here it is. Five bucks. Some of them are kind of yellowed and a bit, but I'll probably just sell them in a lot. I could probably just sell all this in a lot for 20 bucks, I'm sure, and be an easy sell. It's kind of Las Vegas. Maybe I'll throw it on whatnot. It's, you know, Las Vegas, baby. $2.99, I can't pass this up. Little rosebud right here. It's pretty nice. It's a good piece. It might say something down there. I can't quite read. I think it does. I think it does. We need more investigation. I'm gonna have to post on my Facebook. Last time I did, someone told me instantly what the signature was. Steven Carrera, glass. Put it on eBay, less than two days. I sold it for like 65 bones. I didn't even know what it was until then. Two days later, I got 65 bones in my pocket. This bad boy is still gonna be a game time decision. I got a few more items to check out, so, and we're gonna head to another Goodwill.
Let's continue going. I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. Pretty good to pickings today. Yeah, ask Ready? Terry, she knows. So I've been harassing her for Trouble. years. Trouble, that's why my line is always closed when he comes up. What did you find? Mm, this is kind of cool. Yeah, Monster High is what it's called. Ah. People dig it and a bunch of dice. I was wishing I, I could like find those. more. I, I have no idea what I would do with them, but I think they're cool just to look at. <laughs> do people make clocks out of them? Collect yeah, that'd be them? awesome. Uh -huh. All right, that's a good little trip. It's been dry, it's been dry, but you just gotta go. Timing is everything. You just gotta be there at the right time. There's so much, such a fine line between success and failure in so many aspects of life and in thrifting. If someone gets there just a little bit before you, they got it and you don't. So let's head on over to the next door, getting hungry too, and we'll see where the day takes us. All right, this is the second biggest Goodwill. Sounds like there's a bird in here. Sounds like there's a parrot. Oh, hey dudes. We got some hey dudes, no insoles. $7.99 for the Hey Dudes. They are fun shoes. These are decent condition. Got some Hey Dudes at home. Got Super Court, my super wife, wearing some Hey Dudes now too. She wasn't sure about them and then she wore them. She's like, hey dude, I can dig it. So, Hey Dudes. Let's see what else we got. Combat boots, man. I used to always buy combat boots when I didn't know a lot of categories. Combat boots were pretty good and they used to be a lot cheaper back then. Back in the good old days. You know what, folks? This is the good old days right now because everyone says back in the good old days, they never say in the future stuff got cheaper. So this is the good old days right this second and I'm enjoying it. I am enjoying the good old days. All right, Let's see if we got any bags. Let's see if we can see anything new out. Let's see if we see our nemesis or any frenemies or anybody else. Ooh, all right. This this Goodwill does seem to get a lot of furniture, I gotta say. Look at this china cabinet right here for only $19. This bad boy is huge. That's a deal and a steal. Always talking about how priced they are, but if you wanted this thing for $19, where else are you gonna get that for $19? Except at your Goodwill. Oh, got our green chairs complete with cigarette burns in them, just like grandma had. We got Travis Matthew lunch bag right here. Let's see one of these. I wonder if my boy Huey would like that. My nemesis. Oh, just visiting. Is this thing actually old or not old? I love grandma. Oh, it smells like, smells old. Smells old. Oh, look at this pimp cane right here with the loon on it. Whoa, ho, ho. $5.99. See if my friend Coach would like that bad boy. What's the birdie's name? Hi, sir. Uh, the name is Tiny. Tiny. Hi. All right. Say hi, Tiny. I like it. Say yes. I love going out. <laughs> Say I love going out. I take her every day. We we take her to Marshalls. We take her to Ross. Oh, nice. Burlington. The mall. The Apple Store. They they're so great. With, the birds, you know? We're in the brand new rack section. Oh, what is this? is heavy. I think this is gonna be worth it. Originally $19 at the Bombay Company. Is that like the Alibaba of vintage? $6, what is this thing? It's just a brass, brass box. All right. At the OU doll, Betty, 2001, Nancy Williams. She's playing the slot machine, plenty of coins, um, the purse, OU doll. All right, sorry, Betty. We're bouncing out. Betty's friend right here, Babs. On Earth, Babs loves spending her time and money at the slots in Las Vegas. She now spins the heavenly wheel for those hoping a winning combination. Hot diggity dang right here. This. It's what you leave for your slot machine friends, I guess. All right, that's interesting stuff today. We're always, always yeah. learning, that's for sure. Bicycle seat, bicycle seats can do too good, pretty good. I don't know about the poo boo. Oh, we have hit the motherland on the fridge magnets, friends. The whole people's whole fridge went down here. Or a lot of places, Arches National Park, Alaska, Yellowstone, 
Portugal. Oh, now I'm not usually into these fake flowers and plants, but I gotta say they got a nice little section down here. Nice little section. If you need some decorating, if you need some decorating. Oh, friends, I'm kind of getting into Vineyard Vines lately. It's a Target brand, Vineyard Vines XL, and Mikey is more of an XL this year. That's for sure. It's another Goodwill day. My right, friends, we're coming in with the overpriced already. Here we go. This one might be something. Villaroy and Bach. Look at that. Can you see it right there? Villaroy and Bach. They want $20 for it. See, we've got a slide imperfection there. Never heard of it. They obviously looked it up, but for $20, yowch. All right. I'm going to have to look up this company, though. Villaroy and Bach. All right. Examine it. My friends, I usually do research when I see stuff interesting like this, and this one even sell for $20 probably on eBay, so no way we're gonna get it here. The brand itself, I typed in Villaroy Bach Base. It had a very slow sell through. People aren't really looking for this stuff. Easy pass, see how long Goodwill has it. Someone will probably buy it though, it's a nice ace. I just wouldn't. Oh, this is probably a nice one. Made in Japan, Lifton House, it's very beautiful. $6. And pass that up. There's an owl. Ooh, I said now. Uh, this one's got some numbers on it too. Allen's floral container. Probably potpourri in there. Do you put potpourri in there? I'm not sure. All right. We got David in full David glory. Oh, we even have like a colonial picnic here. The whole the whole family's out. Four dollars a pop. We got mom. We got dad. And we got the kids right there, right? Is that the kids? Grandpa? Yeah, yeah, the kids. We got the piano going. No markings on it. I passed up some sandals just the other day. Sandals. Sandals, not sandals. Man, they sold good, decently, and I learned. Oh, we got the Castle Day bags right here. Snow Village, Snow Carnival Palace, Department 56, Snow Village. It just needs light there. It probably had some kind of top right there too. Department 56, Snow Village. All right, I'll have to look that one up too. I always look stuff up. Sometimes when I don't look stuff up and I get home, I'm like, why did I not just look it up while I was there? If I would have just looked it up, I would have known. Just like those sand dolls. Man, they, had, they were signed on the bottom of them. They're Paris, France. All right, I like this. I can dig this clown's gear right here. It's got some style. Gotta have it a little baggy. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, time to leave this area fast. I saw, I saw him right when I, right when I came in. So I was like, I'll stay longer here because he's already over there. Uh, every day, every day we're here. Every day, looking for looking for a little treasure, a little extra lunch money. Okay. Oh, this looks interesting. A leather case. It's from San Juan, Diplicher de Lo Dallas. I don't know what that means. Oh, it means I think this is some kind of wine. Wine case, yeah. You put your wines in there. You got your uh, corkscrew and some other things. Made for some cheese. No leather, six dollars. Interesting. There's there's a little close up of the leather. Yeah. We got dollhouses. We got Huey. Yeah, that's nice, right? Do you know what? What this symbol is? What up, Tao? He's right there. He can't see me. Oh yeah, he can't see me under there. What up, dude? <laughs> Look at this shirt, friends. If we would have got here a few minutes sooner, Star Wars Phantom Menace with the Frito Lay hit on the corner right there. Can you resist? No, I cannot resist just one. You guys know that. Man, Star Wars, the Phantom Menace. 
It's pretty cool. I don't even know what year that is. I don't even think I've seen the whole Phantom Menace all the way through. Oh, here we go. Oh, right there, Lucasfilms 1999. Timing is everything, friends. Timing is everything. Let's give it a Google scan. All right, that's pretty cool. You gotta like it. Yeah, it's gonna look yeah, $850 on eBay, someone's asking. Yeah, right. They are, no they are, no dude. Whatever look that. at that, 850 bucks right there, dude. Here we hit the jackpot. Let's see if any have sold. No. Someone's even watched it. Yeah, dude. I know, I gotta check the sold comps. The guy knows. Yeah, All right, know. let's see. Uh, of course you do. That was, so, <laughs> that was so exciting. All right, let me see. It was a Google. All right. Okay. Shoot, look I got to that rack before that guy here. The guy has got all kinds of stuff in his car. Reseller from California. Oh yeah? He moved out here from LA. I don't know. 280 bucks, dude. Really? Sold? 400, yeah, sold. 495 no right there. Oh, wow. That, but that's not, that's just, they took an offer. Oh, so yeah, dude, that's two, two, it's, it's 250 a, right it's there. A, it's a scoop. That's a scoop, man. I got scooped again by my nemesis. But my dag name nemesis well, got me again. I know, I know. Yeah, I, like, I like the front and the, and the back hit. Dude. You see the sleeves? It's got Frito-Lay. Frito-Lay. I know. It's got the Frito-Lay hit. You can't beat that, dude. You cannot yeah, beat that. Got this on the dude, $280 right there. Are we bagging it? Bagged it. All right, dude. Yeah. Thanks for making me cry once again. Yeah. All right, good one. All right. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. Man, just a few minutes could have been between me and 200 bucks. Everyone's welcome to come here and get the stuff. Amazing, amazing find. They got good stuff at Goodwill. Timing is everything. You just got to be here at the right time. You got to put in work like my boy. He's here every day, so he's working hard. So. But dude, look at that. There's no freaking cracking or nothing. That's the size it's like, XL too, isn't it? No, no it's medium. a medium. It's perfect, dude. It's a $200 shirt for look sure. Look at that. Dude, it's like yeah. I bought it yesterday. Look at I that. Know, for I being know. as old it is, it's I not know, cracked man. or nothing. That's crazy. Shit, someone had this in their house and like never wore it. No, once maybe. Jesus. And then you can, usually you can't even see the dates. Yeah, that's clear as day. Yeah. Crazy. You're rich, man. You're rich now. You're 100 air times two. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see what we got. Got a drill master rotary tool kit. What's up? Um, what else do we got here? Something heavy. Something heavy. A Cobra DC to AC inverter. Yeah. Maybe Google scan that. Let's see what else yeah, we got. in the package. New in the package, the high heat Revlon, $15. Perfect ceramic, I don't know. I'm not going to even look it up. William and... It's like a steering wheel, right? I don't know, that's weird. Yeah, it's a steering wheel right here. William and Smith. Steering wheel clock, pretty interesting. For your favorite driving enthusiast. $10. Oh, well, interesting stuff up here. <laughs> oh, girl, you better have my coffee. Bah, 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 bah. That is, that is a bad cup and a good cup all at the same time. Because when you need coffee, you need it. Look at this horse, Mikey. So, oh, giddy up, Look giddy up. up. That's a horse. You want to get in? We'll move away. Come on in. Come on in. Join, join the, the fun. Yeah, join the fun. Red Bull, New York. What else do we got? Mm -hmm. There's so much here. What's this, Mikey? What is this? It's fruit for uh, orange presser. Orange press. Yeah. That's cool. Patron. That's Branded. Cool. So I guess it's a tequila smasher. Yeah. Genuine leather made in India right here. This looks probably worth a fortune. Need a cart, Mikey. You need a cart? <laughs> Oh, we got the reflex core, softball bat. That's a Yeti. Uh, King Kong. Is it? King is it Kong a Sasquatch? A, King Kong. <laughs> is it a vintage one? I don't know. Oh, that's, is that your cart, Mikey? Yeah. You, you need it. Take it now. I couldn't find anything. Oh, King Kong. All vintage, right. Mikey? I don't know. I can't see it. My eyes don't work. 
It's a canard. Canard. 2008, maybe. 2008? Yeah. Let's Google scan it. That's cool. That's cool, man. Look at that. Thing. Let me see if he comes up. Can't see it, huh? 20, 30 bucks. $30? Ish. Asking. You want it? Nah. How much they want for it? Dude, they only want... Oh, 16, 20, 16. Dude, they only want like $4 for Yeah. Sure? Yeah, $30, $25. If you can find a Canard or 6 million dollars man from 1977, he's worth $265. I wish. Probably like 200 bucks. I just came here while I was dropping off some post office stuff. I had to come see, and if I would have been here five minutes sooner, if I would have came here instead of going to the post office first, might have been the difference between me and two billies. That's the way it goes. You never know what you're missing out on. You might say your place has nothing, it has nothing, it has nothing, but it does have stuff. You just gotta get lucky and be here. Have a good day, Dan. See you, Thank you, bud. All right, so I'm outside the Antique Mall of America on Las Vegas Boulevard South, not too far from the Las Vegas Strip. So this place is actually, man, it's got some dead buildings around it. I'm looking at it right now. Even the apartments across from it where I think people are living looks like a ghost town. The parking lot is a literal ghost town. And I have seen a few people come in. We're here Monday. It's, um, man, about noon. And I got to say, it's pretty, pretty dead. You have to compare prices compared to downtown where it's bustling to over here where it's now rustling. So yeah, we're got Sonny and Carrie are coming along. They're going to be here. We're going to check it out, see what the dealie is, doing some research, hanging out, having some fun. Maybe we'll visit Good Great Fabulous's Desiree's booth. Uh, the Thrifted Owl is another homie that's in there. So let's go see. Marco? Is Marco still up in there? I don't know. I am not sure, but we're gonna go find out. The sky's the limit. The sky's the limit. Antique Mall of America. We're looking at going in this place and potentially making a booth. That one is so Yeah, making a booth. We'll see. And I don't want to Hi guys. Thank you. There's this side, that side, and upstairs. Yep. So let's take a peeky week it. I got a little signed uh, art glass piece. I have friends in town this weekend and we went thrifting. Ooh. And I got, uh, hello. Where'd you go thrifting at? Goodwill? We did Savers um, over on Lake Mead and then we did um, Deseret Ooh. and Goodwill Cheyenne. Nice. That's where I got an art glass little vase and a Fenton blue hobnail slag. <laughs> Cool. $3.99 only. Oh, nice. Sometimes you find will. it, yeah. But you know what I'm saying? Normally they've been like, ah, oh, $12.99. Or they sell it online, yeah. But yeah. sometimes they don't know. They don't know yeah. everything. Yeah. Did you ever see one of these? <laughs> what are those? So they fold up. It's, a ba it's like a roll warmer. So oh. it literally folds into like a little flat thing. I've had two of these. And you open it up and then you put your little warm dinner rolls in there. Ooh, I, I like the sound of that. Yeah, it's cool. Oh yeah, I'm ready for that to be. Desiree, how are you doing? Oh my gosh! Somebody was just talking about you. Yeah, I knew you had a booth here. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I just I'm didn't know where. Oh, oh, we're yeah. thinking about coming in. Really? Yeah. Yeah, but I've seen oh. some of your videos and had some questions and some thoughts about it. But booth life is tough. Booth life is tough. Yeah, and so is glass case life. I've been here June 1st of last year. Wow. So I've been here yeah. almost a year. So do you, you're leaving, but do you have any pointers if we do decide? <laughs> like, what are some things you struggled with in here that makes you want to move out? Honestly, when I first came in, I couldn't keep up. Like I couldn't keep up with, um, cause I was selling stuff so quickly that's a pro and yeah like but the thing is is i couldn't source the stuff that sells where you know oh. well here like so it was hard to keep up yes so then i was just kind of throwing random stuff in and then it wasn't, it wasn't good it wasn't, selling. <laughs> it wasn't good so yeah. um like i was doing jewelry bags and those sell so well yes but 
I mean, I, I can't keep up with it, so I threw random stuff as you can see, and so I'm just gonna pull it all out. The Thrifted Owl, friends. Check it out if you come in here. It's the homie. She wished I wasn't filming that day. Drew my attention. Oh boy. This stem right here, that little swirl and petal light, reminding me of Murano. They had a $25 mark through. It does have Murano on there. Doesn't mean that it is, but I I feel that it is. And they only want $15 for this. Oh my we know who's buying that. <laughs> I am gonna get this. Alright folks, we're rolling out. We checked out some stuff. Who knows? We had a good time. Sunny has made some money. Woo! Meow, 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 meow. All right. 